with a big city feel and plenty of southern charm Raleigh, North Carolina continues to grow in stature and popularity. Visitors can make the most of the modern amenities while never being too far from nature. As the capital of North Carolina, Raleigh is home to some of the state's best museums and galleries. The cultural experiences, along with sporting events and local markets within the downtown core, means there's plenty of things to do in Raleigh. Today we share the top 10 best things to do in Raleigh so you can plan a trip and experience all the exciting attractions and activities this beautiful city has to offer. Starting with number 10, North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences. Across two buildings packed with educational exhibits, the North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences is one of the largest of its kind in the Southeast. Young and old will love diving into the science behind nature while spotting enormous whale and dinosaur fossils in the museum's two-story waterfall. Among the permanent and temporary exhibits, which keep the space fresh for return visitors, you can cross paths with live animals in the Living Conservatory. At number 9 is the Pullen Park. Far from just another urban park, Pullen Park was the first such public space in North Carolina. It continues to be at the forefront of local life thanks to its sprawling lawns, beguiling lakes, and classic carousels. You can even explore the historic park on a miniature train. A fun activity for families and couples is to get out on Lake Howell on a pedal boat. In the fall, the foliage is magnificent, creating a backdrop of orange, purples, and greens as you cruise around the calm waters. You'll find an accessible path around the lake, another great way to explore. At number 8, Umstead State Park. In a state of amazing parks, you'll be happy to know that there's a great one right around the corner. Halfway between Raleigh and Durham, Umstead State Park is made up of three beautiful man-made lakes that split the tree-laden forests. Throughout, you'll find a series of trails that will guide you to the lakes, over scenic bridges and through the heart of the local nature. There are 13 miles of trails to experience, so get your hiking boots strapped up or your bicycle ready to go. At number 7, North Carolina State Capitol. Best seen on the city's historic trolley tour, the North Carolina State Capitol is a beloved landmark and a pristine example of Greek Revival architecture. Built in 1840, the Capitol was the base for the North Carolina State Government for 48 years before becoming the home of the Supreme Court and later the Governor's Office. There are both self-guided and guided tours available for those that want to explore the history of the Capitol building through its many iterations and uses. For others, the tours are a great way to get a further look at the intricate architecture that makes the building so special. At number 6 in our list, North Carolina Museum of Art. Comprising the first state-funded collection of art, the NCMA has a proud focus on cultural representation and diversity. The North Carolina Museum of Art is one of only two art museums in the United States that has a permanent exhibit displaying Jewish works. When the Museum of Art opened in 1956, it began with a meager 74 pieces of art. It quickly expanded to house a wide-ranging collection that includes Egyptian burial works, the Renaissance, ornate sculptures and creations from ancient Greek and the Roman era, along with paintings showcasing early American life. At number 5, J.C. Ralston Arboretum. The beautiful gardens, found on the campus of North Carolina State University, feature some of the most diverse plant life in this part of the United States. Flowers are first evaluated and tested for the conditions before finding a permanent home in the J.C. Ralston Arboretum. Those that fit and thrive in the landscape can be seen throughout the year with a variety of plants blooming in each season. The burst of colors is best seen in the spring and summer where you'll delight at the sight of the blooming iris, rhododendron, hydrangea, and lilies. 
At number 4, Marbles Kids Museum. Parks and history museums only go so far when it comes to entertaining the restless young folks. Thankfully, Raleigh is home to a captivating kid-focused museum that will allow them to stoke their curiosities through a series of hands-on activities. Begin your family day at Marbles Kids Museum by getting your hands on the laminated picture maps. Let the kids plan out their day jumping between activities like the tree tunes, with a focus on music, the STEM learning station, and the smart power grid. At number 3 in our list, Yates Mill. The last of 70 mills in the surrounding area, the historic Yates Mill, is a powerful reminder of early industry around Raleigh, North Carolina. The Yates Mill far outlasted its counterparts, having operated until the 1950s and still features its original equipment today. Between March and October, you can visit the mill where you'll be greeted by period actors grinding the corn. You can get a first-hand insight into how the process works and the importance of the complex to the local agriculture industry. At number 2, Clemens Educational State Forest. Clemens Educational Forest is just one of North Carolina's educational forests. It opened in 1976 and has well-marked trails with educational exhibits along the way. There are also ranger-taught lessons about wildlife and the forest itself. The forest has plenty of picnic areas to relax in when all the learning gets a bit tiring. Like many of Raleigh's attractions, the forest is closed on Mondays but open every other day of the week. Check out the number one places in our list, PNC Arena. As Raleigh's main stadium, the PNC Arena is the place to go for live sports and concerts featuring music's biggest stars. The arena can hold around 20,000 fans who also arrive from neighboring cities like Durham and Chapel Hill. Between October and April, the floor at PNC Arena turns to ice as it plays host to all Carolina Hurricanes home matches in the NHL. When the rink isn't getting carved up by skates, the NC State Wolfpack College basketball team plays right here as they battle to reach March Madness. The process of changing the court is no small feat and can take up to six hours. Now it's time to hear from you what's your favorite things to do in Raleigh. Is there something we missed? Let us know in the comments section below and don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to Greenable if you haven't already clicked the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.